fun fitness segment if you're looking for a little relaxation and bonding with your little one. We're joined today by Katrina Olin Miller from the Early Childhood Development Center at UB, and you've brought some friends with us. Yes. Today we're talking about doing yoga with your baby. We have mom, Sandra, and of course down here we Hi. have Alberto. So let's get right into it. This is a little bit of a strange concept for me, <laughs> but as I'm reading, babies are naturally good at yoga. Yes. So give us a little rundown of why that's so. Well, babies are naturally good at yoga because they're so flexible. They live in the present moment and they have unconditional love and uh, they're just happy in the moment. And so. I was even reading that simple things as they breathe through their nose yes. is going to help with that yes. yoga process. Absolutely. All right, so why don't we sort of get in position. We can okay. uh, start to show some of the things that will happen when you're doing baby yoga and talk uh -huh. about some of the logistics. To okay, it. okay. So Sandra's going to demonstrate the divine drop first, which is really good. You can come on to the mat, which is really um, helpful for babies that are upset. So we'll have you come up here and turn this way. So she's going to make sure that she's supporting his chest and his um, pelvic area and she's going to bend her knees and keep her back straight and she's going to just give him a good drop like that. Now with baby yoga are there things we want to make sure we're doing? Here? Yes, always supporting the baby, always making sure they're comfortable and happy. Um, of course this is one that you can do when your baby is upset to try and help them feel more comfortable. Okay, and so, then uh, what's, uh, what's another position? So another one is called womb wings and she's going to stay with her hands right there. She's going to bend her back and be at a 90 degree angle. <laughs> and bend her knees a little bit and she's gonna swing them like that. And this is really good to do in front of a mirror so the baby can see themselves. So this, it seems like it's not so much what, what you think of yoga as twisting right. into positions, right. but more of, you know, relaxing play. Right, and, and for younger infants, there's some really good um, moves to do to help with digestion or help them get comfortable to sleep and settle down for the night. Now, what are so. some things we want to avoid when we're, we're practicing baby yoga or if, if this is something we do want to try? Right, so, so, You'd never want to move the baby's body in a way that it wouldn't naturally move. And to always make sure that they're comfortable and happy. Um, that's which, about it. Which yeah. is. Yeah. Now, is this something also that you'd probably want to talk to someone that knows a little bit more about it? Or can you sort of look up videos and try it yourself? Um, you could you could do videos by yourself. Yeah, they're all essentially. I mean, it's work for mom too, so it's a really good bonding time. It's a it's a really good way to make sure that you're developing a relationship with your baby and bonding and making routines a time when you can do things with your baby and not just to your baby. Now we do have a graphic of the five reasons why babies are naturally mm -hmm. good at yoga, and I want to go back to that graphic because there's some okay. points that I, I think that we missed over. It's you know simple things like the baby practices nonviolence. Yeah. Right. Right. So, so how does that kind of work into yoga? Um, because it's it's calming, it's peaceful, and I mean babies are not violent creatures. So. And then what about uh, babies naturally stand in yoga positions? I thought that was very interesting. Uh, well, there's over 8,000 different asanas, so essentially everything that you do is almost a yoga move. All right, well, I want to thank adults. you guys so much yep. for coming in. And thank you, Alberto, for being Thanks such so a much. good sport. <laughs> but right now we're going to head back over to Jordan to see what's happening with the desk check.